Hey football fans, welcome back to Football News Center. We've got some concerning news today about Crystal Palace manager Roy Hodgson. During Thursday morning's training session, Hodgson was taken ill, leading to the cancellation of the pre-match press conference ahead of Monday's Premier League fixture against Everton. This isn't the first time Hodgson's health has been a concern this season. He previously missed a match against Aston Villa in September due to feeling unwell on the morning of the game. On that occasion, assistant manager Paddy McCarthy took charge of the team alongside coach Ray Lewington. Speculation about Hodgson's future at Palace has been swirling for weeks, with reports suggesting that the club is set to part ways with him. The leading candidate to replace him is Oliver Glasner, the head coach of Eintracht Frankfurt. Crystal Palace started the season well, collecting seven points from their first four games. However, their form has dipped since September with only three wins and a disappointing exit from the FA Cup in the third round at the hands of Everton. The recent 3-1 home defeat to Chelsea was their fourth loss in five games, and during the humiliating 4-1 defeat to arch-rivals Brighton and Hove Albion, some fans even called for Hodgson and chairman Steve Parrish to leave the club. Hodgson, who is currently 76 years old, is in his second spell at Crystal Palace. He was reappointed in March 2023 on a short-term contract after the sacking of Patrick Vieira. After successfully steering the club away from relegation, he signed a one-year deal last summer. Prior to his return to Palace, Hodgson spent four years in charge of the club from 2017 to 2021. He then had a short-term stint at Watford in January 2022, but after their relegation to the Championship, he confirmed his departure. At the time, he didn't expect to take another managerial job in the Premier League, but he returned to lead Crystal Palace just 10 months later. We hope Roy Hodgson makes a swift recovery and wish him all the best. Stay tuned to Football News Centre for updates on this situation and more. Don't forget to subscribe to The Athletic for exclusive stories and in-depth coverage of your favourite players, teams, leagues, and clubs. Try it out for a week on us. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.